What it do, flight crew? FTC. Flight team stand up! We got the Minnesota Timberwolves at the San Antonio Spurs. NBA in season tournament! The Wolves got Edwards of Anthony, Rudy Gobert, Cat. Gobert has kind of returned to Rudy of old as the Stifle Tower, a rebounder, shot talker. Close on the team? Try to fit a lot of different roles within the And the rest are nobodies. The Spurs. Plus the T-Wolves are off to a solid start. So Wet bananas. Yeah, well, so Vaseline dude, the Sohan dude, number 23, the assistant principal, Johnson the Kyub, Wet Bananas, did I already say his name? I don't remember, and the rest are nobodies, check it out, this is technically like part two of the NBA in season, right, we watched the Wolves about a couple of days ago, Wet Bananas! Bro, right off that pass from his teammate, I was hoping he was good, too. He looked at, he, that thing is good. He just had the ball in his hand. You see how simple, bro? Like, even just like an on-the-floor pass. Like, first of all, bro, the Wolves are crazy. They're double-teaming Vaseline. That's just going to leave wet bananas open. Like nothing. I see you, Wimby. Bro, the Sperm's court in the NBA season is so fire, bro, in, in the uh, highlights. I wonder how they look in person. I wonder if they're like really bright or they're just dull color. Got McConley and Michael passing it to Cat, pulling it up. Bottoms. Got a backdoor cut to the Johnson dude. Got Wemby, what you talking about? Good pass, the assistant principal. He's gonna finish. That was nice. Did the Spurs get new, like, even tracksuit, like, warm up jerseys, too? They're, like, brownish. Those, bro, yo, those kind of look fire, bro. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> NBA in season having some, like. The, the, I don't lie, the, only, the biggest positive you could definitely say to it or is it is that at least we're getting like refreshing different jerseys and courts. It makes the NBA look more vintage when you look at it like 10 or 20 more years later. Alexander Walker gives it up to Edwards. Towns, now Alexander Walker. on the shot clock. Got a 20 day contract player with that fadeaway. Nice. Got Wimby. Ah, that was a bad pass. Bad pass, you gotta work on that. Uh, Anderson, the other that's a tough pass to make, I will say, as a real hooper hooper. When you're already sky high in the air and trying to throw a straight line drive pass, at least, especially if you're taller than a person. Wet bananas! He makes a right for it, bro, with a spot up smothered mid range shot. This is crazy. Rudy Go, bro, it's crazy. Rudy Gobert is, remember, he's seven feet. <laughs> it ain't like he's 6'5 guarding Wimby, bro. This dude is literally seven feet. And he made him look like he was a little boy. I like those Wimby. Wet bananas! Cat, you the man. You the man, cat. But bro literally just took your move in front of your face. This is a dangerous thing about wet bananas. I think that, like, he low key just unlocked this game, or maybe he had it, and I just figuring out now. Wet Bananas reminds me, well, not obviously all the way, but he definitely has a badge or a, um, what do you, I guess, attribute perk or whatever. I feel like he has that little cell absorb thing that, you know, remember when he was watching DBZ, when y'all caught DBZ back in the day, and then, like, bro, Cell was low-key the most frustrating person, bro, because, like, he had zero fighting skills and zero talent. But once that needle come out, bro, he literally can suck somebody up, pause, all right? Hear what I'm saying? With the needle and suck their powers out or just, like, is able to absorb what they're basically able to do. You know what I'm saying? Wet Bananas, bro, this is his first time playing Cat a day in his life. And he literally absorbed Cat's power-up signature spot-up shot. Him, like, I, Cat and the beat are probably, like, the top NBA players I was known for this, like, little... Spot up animation shot. You know what I'm saying? That quick little, you know what I'm saying? One, two, jab step. You know what I'm saying? After turning around in the post and then spotting up like that. Bruh, you can just tell he just learned that probably just from watching the game film 
uh, before the game uh, took place. This is beautiful, bro. This is the thing that's going to make Wet Banana stand up behind like a lot of NBA players in history and even right now. He's always going to be improving, bro. It's not like... it's just, he, Bro, I think Steph Curry... And wet bananas, when it's going to be said and done within the next five years, are definitely going to be the top two NBA players. 100%. Because the example I basically was going to say, Curry is also in the same status as well. When it comes to players that are actively just seeming like they're progressing as they're getting older and just learning new things about the game, when you think that it's reached their limit like everybody just thought curry was just a, uh, is just a straight up three-point shooter you know what i'm saying coming out of college coming out of davidson and then he ended up you know what i'm saying turning into an elite passer now he's a top five passer of all time in right now you know what i'm saying he's an amazing ma mid-range shooter he always was able to shoot the mid-range honestly before coming to the nba but you know what i'm saying he's a top five best nba mid-range shooter right now in all of all time you know what I'm saying? And so on in other categories, even such as like defense. You know what I'm saying? I think Curry is respectable top five point defensive point guard right now in an NBA history, especially for someone that's his size. What bananas, man, he's in the same category and status. He's just gonna be improving and learning new moves and learning new IQ plays and learning do's and those. And even if it doesn't even have anything to do with actually being on a basketball court, he could probably learn different IQ or something like that outside of just basketball. You feel me? So it's just incredible to see. Bro, this is a generational inspirational talent, bro. I've never seen. We've watched many Wet Bananas highlights before he was even touching the league. You guys know that. You just look at the channel. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's why it'd be funny when people be like, oh, D right, this and that. But it'd be hard for them to keep up with that. It's okay, Wet Bananas. We all miss one. Um, because I'm literally the OG Day One Wet Banana supporter. He was even commenting on the damn videos, bro, when we was first reacting to him in uh, overseas games. Go and look. <laughs> Just incredible to see, bro. Nice pump fakes to Vaseline. In the corner like a prize to deep. Yeah, the Spurs logo was fire, too. What the hell? Bro, no glaze, dog. Yo, I think... Whoever the graphic designer is for the entire, like, Sperm's organization, bro, yo, they got to get a raise or something, bro. Because out of every NBA team in the entire NBA in-season tournament, at least, bro, these were the top-tier people. This person needs to get hired, at least, for something beyond the NBA, maybe, like, movies or something. Because this is some amazing graphic design. Like, they low-key transformed the entire franchise. This looks like a new NBA team. They need to hire whoever was designing this person, the designer for the Sperm's team right here. When the expansion NBA comes and they add more teams, you know they're going to add like one or two more teams within the next five to ten years in the NBA if you've been doing your research. Um, I believe um, the number one candidates uh, for getting a new NBA like team is in Vegas. Um, and then there's been talks about like Seattle trying to get like a team coming back or whatever. That will be fire. Uh, but, yeah, bro, uh, they need to anyway hire whoever it is uh, definitely because they literally transformed and brought back. <laughs> Crazy. Got the Johnson dude, pass the Vaseline, the Adams. Got Cat, nice pass Cat. One more pass, got a 20 day contract player going to the rack with the lucky and one. Got Edwards of Anthony, just gonna pull up like that, Bottoms. Going at it. Got Edwards. I ain't gonna lie, I might be copping Edwards shoes. Hey, I don't know if they're Edwards or Harden shoes. Because I feel like one of them, they're Adidas, right? They look the same as somebody else's design. But I don't know what, that design of those Adidas look like some vintage 0000 shoes. Ooh! I was trying to talk about that the last Will Wolves game, but I forgot what threw me off track, actually. I remember I brought that up. Bro, that was nasty by Edwards. I ain't gonna lie to you. Duh. <laughs> got a 20 day concept player frying up a three. Get the three to 50. First half coming to an end. Wet the up. Oh, yep. Pass the ball better. Way better than that. Weapon hands are so uh, tall. It don't matter. Weapon hands! <laughs> Bro! 
Oh, yeah. Wet Bananas is officially... I've already been said this, but he's officially a problem in the NBA. He's going to be a problem for a long time. Look at the way Edwards is looking at him down the court. Bro, this nigga is looking at him direct eye contact, bro, about 50 yards down the court. Nigga, inbounds the ball. You act like you lost the game. You act like you're getting blown out, bro. This nigga... Edwards is triggered, my nigga. He, bro, Edwards has never even made a shot that far a day in his uh, basketball career, bro. And he has somebody that is 11 foot 7 making a shot with no effort at all, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. If we have to look at uh, three point percentages, like what's 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 like certain players' three point percentages? Because Wet Bananas probably might be in the top 10 three point uh, shooters this year. Uh, so far, obviously Curry is is in that top five. You got Clay; he's been playing amazing. Um, I'm trying to think of some other NBA players that's been shooting three. Maybe uh, how, how's Donikic been doing lately? Um, maybe he might be in there, and maybe like one of those three point shooters that's going to be in like the All Star teams and shit. But bro, Wet Bananas, I think he'd be possibly even top seven three point shooter. This they need to start counting this as a four point in the NBA. Remember when Jimmy Howard was talking Touchdown, about this? Six in the clock, fires a deep three. Damn. Get the rebound here. You got an excellent chance for the last shot of the half. Tom D. Got the Tommy and Michael. It's a uh, nice lucky shot. You only started shooting those threes when you seen Curry play, buddy. <laughs> Yo, knowledge. Yo, really mean knowledge up there. You know, you know. Man, McCauley and Michael been in the league for about a century in this bit. Wet bananas! Wow, bro. Just a spot up pull up three. Holy. 2K better have his three point rating for like his regular player build. That's not obviously in my team because you know my team stats is like jacked up. But like, if it's like in an online rank match, his three got to be at least 85 and above. Is anybody still on 2K? <laughs> I ain't even gonna lie to you. This might have been like the quickest 2K has died out, dog. That's insane. You know Ronald and Mike Wayne is not going to be in that office come 2024. <laughs> I tried to warn them, bro. That's what happens when you get lazy. That's what happens when you don't care about the community. This ain't even about 2K, bro. This is the Sperms and the Timberwolves NBA in season plan. Fuck Ronnie and Mike Wayne! We got a steal by a 20-day contract player. Down the court! Finger roll! The zone is confounding us again. Got wet bananas already getting double team pass to the assistant principal. You ain't Michael Jordan, baby. Take off that number 23. Those sperms jerseys are so fire, bro. I remember we raided them in the city, uh, the, or not the city, but the new NBA in, uh, in season tournament jerseys. Or what are they called the cities? I think, yeah. We got Vaseline. Quick pass up. Wet bananas. Come on, wet bananas. Dunk that one next time. I thought he had a bloody nose for a second. I was like, who hit who hit wet bananas upside the nose? We gotta pull up? I'm just playing. Ooh! Edwards gliding midair. Nigga looking like Prime MJ in 91, but nigga just missing the retro sixes. Or was it the retro sevens that was out? I don't know, nigga. I wasn't born. That's why he passed the wet bananas. Is he on the floor? Why is not wet bananas on the floor? Look at the score. Holy shit. Man, that weak ass lip. Got Cat. She's going to pull up. Bottoms. I see you, Cat. We got a floater alert. About a 35 day contract player. Got somebody's uncle with the spot up three. <laughs> Weapon ass on the floor. There he goes. Wet Bananas, quick pass. I see Wet Bananas have a rotate on that. He could have blocked that from behind easily. Easily. Wet Bananas in the post. Fading away. Damn. Oh, my goodness. And I want you to realize, too, he was he turned the wrong way, too. 
You know what I'm saying? He turned the wrong way and was off balance with that fadeaway. Wow. Comes off the go bear screen. Rebound to the Spurs. Weapon bananas! Oh! He just did a 2K reverse dunk! Bro, he barely jumped! I spot the Wolves bench. Look at his knee. Look at these niggas. <laughs> Bro, these niggas is ooh and an eye. Look at these three dudes right here. Four. Look at that out. Five. The whole Wolves bench is ooh and an eye. And they ain't do that for not one of their teammates. <laughs> Yo, no, no, no. And he got exposed by their own start. Yo, look at Edwards. He's looking at the bench like, damn, he really just did that shit. Dog, this guy is crazy nice. You can't make this up, bro. you never seen Shaq be able to do this before, bro. Yo. Goodness. See Edwards? Got a quick pass to Rudy Gobert! It's not gonna I can't see for 15 games, buddy. I remember that last game. <laughs> Yo, we didn't forget that. <laughs> Nigga. Bro had a top five facial of the year, bro. Getting packed. Running down the fast break. You got the Sohan dude. Pass it to the Vaseline. Okay. Will the sperms come back? Sohan, pass the ball to Weapon and You're getting triple team. You're not even that good. Throw it a 2K fake pass. That worked. Wow, Spurs is coming back back. You got a quick screen. Vaseline spotted it. Oh! Holy! What the hell? They only dropped by like two. Got Edwards splitting the double team off the pick and roll. We got Cat. That's a smart double. Ah, wet banana shouldn't have went away. Yeah, Cat's gonna make those. Wet bananas! Wet bananas! What did I tell y'all about them half court alley oops? We got a smart guy right here. He's finally getting it. He's finally getting it, bro. They could do this all game, especially when this is like the second <laughs> and third quarter and maybe the top of the fourth quarter when niggas are trying to catch their breath again. They not back on defense in time after, especially they just scored. Look at them. Look at them. Look at the Timberwolves, man. They don't know what the fuck they got to do. They don't know what they doing. 111, 101. Ah, uh, Wemby should have been down low in the paint. Got Sohan with a lucky three. It might be his first three of his career. Wet bananas. Just gonna spot up. Oh my fucking goodness, dog. Oh no. Oh gosh. Yo, yo. I ain't even gonna lie. Wet bananas gotta move up in the rankings at this point. Fuck it. Wet bananas gotta move up in the point. No bullshit, bro. Now, hear me out, hear me out, hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. I think Wet Banana's got to be, at this point, a better ball player than Larry Bird. You got to move up past him, at least. There's some other NBA players we got to think about. Um, that's in that, like, top 10, you know what I'm saying, area. Who else? Yeah, he got it. He yeah, I th I think that's that was like the close. Cause you know, some people will say Larry could be in the top seven. The, he's definitely in the top fifteen. I'll put him around there. But yeah, no, definitely. Wemby all are already got to be better than Larry right there, bro. That shot right there. This shot right there is literally carrying the NBA right now, dog. You can't make this up. Bro, he did a fading drifter with this offside. He is right-handed. Fading away to the left side when you're right-handed is literally like harder than Yale math, bro. But the Spurs end up losing the uh, end season tournament, so that means they're eliminated from the playoffs? What does that mean again?
All right, let's go ahead and look at this box score, and that's going to cap it off. This probably may have been low-key the better Wet Bananas uh, plays that he's made. Bro, like the fading threes and more. You can tell just even like off of this game alone, Wet Bananas is getting a lot more comfortable in the NBA. He's getting a lot more looser. He still needs to, you know, obviously get his strength up. I'm always going to continue to preach that until he reaches that, you know what I'm saying, at least like, you know, decent, a tempo size. Um, you know, at times he still is a, a tad bit un uncoordinated. But, bro, with the fading, drifting threes, the way he's moving around the court, the way he's like calling out certain plays, even the way he's showing emotion, bro, and getting mad at certain things. You know what I'm saying? He's getting a lot more comfortable and accustomed with just, you know what I'm saying, the basketball culture. When it comes to like, you know, playing ball in the Americas, man. It's just absolutely amazing. Um, Edwards of Anthony had 28 points, 29 for Cat. Rudy Gober with 11. Uh, Wet Bananas with 29 points. Wow. Just a tad bit too lazy to get one more point that would add him 30. You guys understand the flight reacts effect, bro. Wet Bananas is officially getting 35 minutes now. This is, wow, Popovich. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, man. I love it, man. I love seeing, you know what I'm saying, the old heads finally, like, put the pride aside and tap in, you know what I'm saying, to the younger side. And, you know what I'm saying, finally looking at, you know what I'm saying, the social media and, and, and the stuff because they're finding a lot of hidden gems. Popovich definitely, you know what I'm saying, was on the couch, you know what I'm saying, 2 a.m. in the morning. And it was like, damn, bro. You know what I'm saying? Even though the Sperms lost his game, this is a good loss because this is a lot of improvement that we're seeing that they was not doing. That's not going to keep them stuck in the hole when it comes to about halfway, midway into the NBA season, especially after around All-Star break. Popovich is now playing Wet Bananas 35 minutes. Finally, this is exactly what Wet Bananas is going to average his entire career. And this is just considerably just a minimal, like, not even a bad game, but just a, a good game. There's a difference between a good game and a great game, obviously. You know what I'm saying? Two different vocab words. This is literally a stat line right here. Some may be like, I could definitely maybe a couple more rebounds when he gets a little bit more stronger, but it's only his rookie year. Finally, he is playing 35 minutes, and look at the results. Everybody at this point that called Wet Bananas a bust, what do you have to fucking say now? He is living up above all the expectations. Unfortunately, I hate to even admit it, he is better and surpassed rookie LeBron. LeBron was never putting up these numbers like this when he was a rookie. Obviously, later on in his career, a year or two after, he obviously is. All right, so don't try and clip that and thank you, God. <laughs> some, some, some engagement. Relax. This We're only talking about rookie season. Guys. This is a 13 foot 2 NBA player doing this. And this is amazing. I already told you guys I have a talent for seeing talent. Don't let that go over your heads, man. And it's crazy. And it, it, it sounds kind of, you know what I'm saying, bad in a way to say it. But am I wrong for saying that? What if even like players like Vaseline and Johnson have killed, and even though Johnson killed and struggled? Uh, this game, what if they decided to pass the ball a little bit more and take five less shots? This stat line is easily going to be 36, 14 rebounds, seven assists with ease. Guys, he has to make the all-star game this year instantly. He's the number one big man, not only in the NBA, but in the entire world. He surpassed a lot of big men, a lot of great NBA players, even just with this game alone and showing different highlights, bro. Incredible.